हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर डूइंग चैप्टर नंबर थ्री शेयर्स एंड डिविडेंट एक्सरसाइज थ्री इन प्रीवियस वीडियो टिल क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव वी हैव डिस्कस नाउ वी आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स अ लेडी होल्ड्स थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड हंड्रेड रुपी शेयर्स ऑफ अ कंपनी दैट पेज फिफ्टीन परसेंट डिविडेंट एनुअली कैलकुलेट हर एनुअल डिविडेंट इफ शी हैड बॉट दीज शेयर्स एट फोर्टी परसेंट प्रीमियम वट परसेंट इज रिटर्न डज शी गेट ऑन हर इन्वेस्टमेंट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल सी वट ऑल इज गिवन इन द क्वेश्चन दे टोल्ड हियर अ लेडी होल्ड थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड मीन्स दिस इज गिवन नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स सो नंबर ऑफ शेयर्स थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड means this is the face value face value is 100 rupees share that pays 15% dividend dividend rate is 15% if she had bought these shares at 40% premium so market value will be 100 rupees plus 40% of 100 rupees these shares are available at 40% above so 40% of 100 rupees will be 40 so market value we will get here 140 rupees now we have to calculate here annual dividend so dividend is equal to number of shares into dividend percentage into face value number of shares we have 1800 dividend percentage is 15% and face value is 100 rupees 100 to 100 you can cancel out and these two 18 and 15 you can multiply you will get 27000 is dividend second thing we have to find out here what percentage return she get on her investment so first we will calculate investment then we will calculate return percentage investment is equal to number of shares into market value number of shares is here 1800 multiply by 140 so after multiplication we are getting 252 and triple zeros next return percentage will be dividend upon investment into 100% The dividend we are getting twenty seven thousand. Investment is two lakh fifty two thousand multiply by hundred percent. Cancel out two zeros one zero here also you can cancel out. Then cancel with four table four six and three four six twenty four seven twenty eight and five. Cancel with the seven table or nine table. Nine seven just sixty three six seven just sixty three and five seventy five upon seven. So seventy five upon seven percentage we are getting, which after changing to fraction we will mix fraction we will get ten whole number five by seven percent. Next we have question number seven. What sum should a person invest in twenty five rupees share selling at thirty six rupees to obtain an income of seven twenty rupees? If the dividend declared is twelve percent, also find the percentage return on his income. So first they have given here invest in twenty five rupees share selling at thirty six rupees. It means twenty five is the face value. And thirty six is the market value. So face value is here twenty five rupees, and market value is thirty six rupees. Income is seven twenty rupees. Income or you can say dividend. 
is seven twenty rupees. If the dividend declared at twelve percent, dividend percentage is twelve percent. So we have to find out the return percentage. So for that we need investment, and for investment we need number of shares. So let the number of shares is X. Then we know dividend is equal to number of shares into dividend percentage into face value. Substitute all the values. Dividend we got here seven twenty rupees. Number of shares we have taken x. Dividend percentage is twelve percent. Face value is twenty five rupees. Cancel out twenty five four and four three ja. Three, you can shift another side. It will come for division. So x value we are getting two forty. So here we have two forty shares. So first we'll calculate uh, investment. Investment is equal to number of shares into market value. Two forty shares are there, and market value is thirty six rupees. After multiplication, eight thousand six forty rupees we are getting. Next, we have to calculate return percentage. Return percentage is equal to dividend by investment into hundred percent. So dividend is here seven twenty rupees. Investment is eight thousand six forty rupees into hundred percent. Zero to zero, you can cancel out. Then six one and six two zero. Then six one six four zero twenty four and four zero. Again, you can cancel twelve one zero twelve twelve zero one forty four four three zero and four twenty five zero. So twenty five by three, we are getting. Which you can change into mixed fraction by eight whole number, one by three percent. Question number eight. Ashok invested twenty six thousand four hundred on twelve percent rupees twenty five share of a company. If he receives a dividend of two thousand four seventy five rupees, find the number of shares he bought and the market value of each share. So first, they have given here Ashok invest twenty six thousand four hundred rupees. It means this is the investment. Next on twelve percent, this is the rate of dividend. Rupees twenty five share. This is face value of share. If he receive a dividend, this is dividend in rupees. Twenty two thousand four seventy five. So first we'll take let number of shares is equal to x. We know dividend is equal to number of shares into dividend percentage into face value. Dividend we got here two thousand four seventy five rupees. Number of shares we have taken x. Dividend percentage is twelve percent. Face value is twenty five. Twenty five four ja and four three times you can cancel out. Shift three another side. So x we are getting three eight two and five. A twenty five shares he bought. Now we have to calculate market value. We know investment is equal to Number of shares into market value. So you can substitute here values. Investment is twenty six thousand four hundred. Number of shares eight twenty five and market value we have to calculate. 
सो मार्केट वैल्यू विल बी टू ट्वेंटी सिक्स थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड डिवाइडेड बाई एट ट्वेंटी फाइव कैंसल आउट विथ फाइव टेबल वन सिक्सटी फाइव टाइम्स दैन फाइव फाइव टू एंड एट टाइम अगेन फाइव थर्टी थ्री टाइम्स फाइव वन ज़ीरो फाइव सिक्स टाइम्स दैन यू कैन कैंसल विथ इलेवन टेबल इलेवन थ्री जा नाइन जा एंड सिक्स जा थ्री थर्टी टू सो हेयर मार्केट वैल्यू ऑफ वन शेयर इज थर्टी टू रुपीज क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन्थ अ मैन इन्वेस्ट फोर फोर थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड रुपीज इन शेयर ऑफ अ कंपनी which is paying 7.5% dividend if rupees 100 share are available at a discount of 10% find the number of shares he purchases and his annual income so first investment is given 4500 rupees in a share of company which is paying 7.5% dividend dividend rate is 7.5% if 100 rupees share means this is the face value of share face value is 100 rupees available at a discount of 10% so market value will be 100 rupees minus 10% of 100 so 100 minus it will come 10 so market value is 90 rupees now first we have to find out the number of shares we know investment is equal to number of shares into market value investment we have 4500 rupees number of shares we don't know and market value is 90 rupees so number of shares will be 4500 divided by 90 so we are getting here 50 shares next we have to find out the annual income annual income or dividend it is same annual income is equal to number of shares into dividend percentage into face value of share substitute values number of shares we have calculated 50 rate of dividend is 7.5% face value is 100 rupees 100 to 100 you can cancel out and these two you can multiply 375 rupees is his annual income next question number 10 amit kumar invested 36000 rupees in buying 100 rupee share at 20 rupees premium The dividend is fifteen percent per annum. Find the number of shares he buys, his yearly dividend, and the percentage return on his investment. So here it is given. Amit Kumar invests thirty-six thousand rupees. It means investment is thirty-six thousand rupees. In buying hundred rupee share, this is face value. At twenty rupees premium, so market value will be hundred rupees plus twenty means one twenty rupees. Dividend is fifteen percent. First, we have to find out the number of shares. So, number of shares will be investment upon market value. Investment we have thirty six thousand. Market value is one twenty rupees. You can cancel out. So we are getting here three hundred shares. Second part we have to calculate the yearly dividend. Dividend is equal to number of shares into dividend percentage into face value. number of shares we have calculated 300 dividend percentage is 15% and face value is 100 rupees 
after multiplication we are getting dividend is 4500 rupees third part we have to calculate his return percentage so return percentage is dividend upon investment into 100% dividend we got 4500 rupees investment was 36000 rupees into 100% cancel out 94 and 950 to 2 and to 25 so we are getting 25 by 2 percent or 12 whole number 1 by 2 percent in this video we are doing till here remaining questions we will continue in the next video thank you for watching this video